I can add scars. Shanks, if you know who that is. Why do I look like that? <laughs> what is that? Ah, that is not me. It appears we are almost ready to depart. Oh, I got money. Oh, hey, I didn't break that one. But I didn't break that one. And you've a ready mind. Quick to learn. Perhaps you belong in yes. Ravenclaw. Yes, I do. Oh, I could have just picked, like, which one? I mean, this is what I was trying to get, but... Dang. All right, welcome back. I didn't expect that first video to do as well as it did. I'm gonna be honest. I put little to no effort into that video. I was just kind of having fun with it. But it seems like more people than I initially thought are interested in it. So here we are. I'm gonna be making a second episode, something I didn't see myself doing. Hope you liked that little recap episode. Tried to get a little meme with it. It's my first, my first intro and my first recap segment, I guess you could say. Never really had to edit, edit before, you know? Like, I know how to use the blade function and, like, just stick clips next to each other and, like, overlay audio. This should not <laughs> be loading this slowly. Even the boot up took forever. Like, I think this is the only game that I have that is constantly struggling to load. Well, I've been talking a fat minute. I'll just pause it, I guess, and come back when we're loaded in. I spoke way too soon. <laughs> Here we are, guys. And I'm just now realizing after rewatching my recordings that there are four beds here. So I got more than just one roommate. Ew. Look at these unloaded textures. Gross. So like a lot of games, they have the mirror as like your change. It doesn't look like I can change my clothes there. Yo. I'm just walk into the door and it opens. Let's go upstairs. Oh, is that where I'm supposed to go? Never mind. <laughs> you guys are gonna quickly find out I'm the kind of person that just goes everywhere they're not supposed to be before actually getting on with it. Oh, the room is a little different. They got like a horizontal mirror. They only got three chairs. Three chairs in here. So not everyone can study, it seems. It's quite cool that you can just walk into people's rooms, though. Oh, is there just, like, so little kids at Hogwarts that, like, live on campus that you just have, like, four per Oh, see? This is why you explore in the wrong direction. Whatever. We'll come back. I found it. Yep, they got the cool mirror. They even got like this hourglass thing going on. I wish my reflection were a little cooler. Let's get out of here. Oh, I was walking into the... Ooh, let's steal this broom. I guess I can't. To the... Oh, what's this door? Oh, it's the bathroom. Jenny! Jenny, are you here? I know it's not this bathroom, but... Oh, I can use the bathroom. Oh, that's so lame. I can just turn on faucets. And flush toilets. I could be a janitor in this game, guys. You ever think that was going to happen in this kind of game? So, I, I assume, right, that this is split into the boys and girls dorms
There's no way that that was like a I suppose <laughs> co -ed bathroom. Oh, is this the girl's side? Yeah, this must be the girl's side, right? How many floors are there? Hey, who said that? Yo, we got a problem? It was you. I know it was you. You're the only one to say some ignorant. What is this? What is this? Oh, I could do this all day, guys. Just have to wait for the right moment. Oh, don't tell me it was her. This, this, this chick that said that? I'm not sure this is the right spot. No, it was a different voice. It was someone else around here that said that. I'll find him. I'll want battle him. I'm going to zap him too. Oh, can I zap her? I didn't do anything. It's not me. Oh, let me know if there's any like notable difference in the audio, guys. I'm trying out some new OBS settings. Oh, but then see whose room is this? Because this is, this is the side I just walked up, right? So this this side logically is the girls. So is this like the top floor where it's like guys on this side, girls on this side? None of this matters, by the way. I just can't focus. Do I have ADHD? Maybe. I'm undiagnosed. Never thought to go and get myself checked. Can we watch this in real time? Like, is this just going to keep going? Yeah, wow. Ooh, Lumos. I can do it too. Whoa. Ooh, spiral stairs. Thought that was like a Ouija board at like first glance. Oh, this is so sick. Oh. So level one. Oh, oh, oh. Who are you? She's cool. She's cool. <gasps> Another one. Wee. Okay. Let's actually go and talk to these people now. Gotta, gotta advance the story. This should be interesting. You, Samantha Dale. Do I have to go around the table? I want him to be in the perfect place. Place he'll be happy with. Why are you talking to me like you know me? It. Great Hello? golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Who is him? Golden gobstones. <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. You're a Dittling seedling. Is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. Who are you? <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. David. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? David Azaflin. Is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wiganwell potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. How? Oh. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. He is quite knowledgeable. Fig does know a great deal. He's about, weird. Um different forms of magic well i hope he told you about more than wig and weld you've lots to catch up on i'm sure uh yeah that's literally all he told me about i feel like both of these are kind of dumb questions but i don't want to like just finish talking i feel like there's more to like do it hufflepuff i mean if you take it by their name i think i know which plants they like to grow an affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinary. Look at all these losers in the background with their light spell. We have a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose. I say, is it's the only spell I can do other than Ravelio? Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh yes. <laughs> yeah, man. Our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. Garlic. I don't think Professor
us a sharp our potion. There's no way. Who cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. They made a teacher called Professor Garlic. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your ditany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. It's my first day and she's talking to me like she's known me like 87 years. Oh, I ate an apple. That's just brilliant, Amit. Brilliant. You think you could... Ah, that is not how that... I don't know how to say that name. Ami? Why, hello. Is that Would what he you said? Would you like to take a look? Ami. What kind of name is that? I don't think I've ever heard of someone with that name. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. Sirius! I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Oh, so he did Never say Amit. Met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. What? Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. Yo, fun fact. In college, I've actually taken a Hawaiian astrology class. But it was it was more than out well. I would not say it's astrology. It's more so the study of how the stars positions in the sky and the path of the sun and moon affect our natural world, especially here in Hawaii. So, for example, when specific moons are out, certain plants, when they fruit, if they're like fruiting plants and whatnot, they will be at their ripest. And it might sound like mumbo jumbo, but stuff like the Hawaiian moon calendar having 30 days and on specific moons, you have king tides, you have low tides, and because of the earth and sun's position, it's very science backed. It's using modern science to back up previous ideas and improve upon them in Hawaiian astrology. If you guys ever want to hear a little about that, I'd be down. I still got my notes from class. <laughs> I do I find the stars fascinating, though. Sounds interesting. I hope it is I have indeed. Good news for you. You are most definitely taking astronomy. Ooh. It is required for all fifth years. I like that. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Be seeing you. Quick add on to what I said earlier. The full moon in Hawaiian is called Oku. Right Everett Clopton. That's an easier name to say. One moment. Watch this. Oh, we got the same hair, man. Uh, what is this? Someone uh, threw a dumb bomb. Gertrude. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Wait. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, well. Wait. Right. What did you hope would happen? Gertrude? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. She looked very familiar. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. How do you know? How does everyone know about that, like, little misadventure? I don't recall telling anyone. I, like, walked in, did my sorting ceremony, went straight to my room. How does anybody know about all of that? I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Ah, uh, the wall blinked at me. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Ah, uh, it's the magic poop spray. Professors are firm, but fair. Ha, I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bong back to me. Nice meeting you. You too, Dude, You're standing in the walkway where people can hey there, see you. New Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You would best not keep Hold on, guys. Waiting. Okay. I am back. Sorry, my mommy was calling me. <laughs> oh. Hey, hey. Come back here. Why are you rude? Huh? Oh, not him. 
Yeah. Uh huh. No. Yeah. Keep, keep moving. Oh, can I get this? No. But what is this? Place what? What am I placing? Oh. That's cool. That's cool. Hello. Hey, you too. Watch your mouth. Who are you? Oh, they're downstairs. <laughs> Whoops. Don't, don't do that. Oh. Good morning. You. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Sure, sure, sure. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. My what? OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have <laughs> when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster like and the department of magic SATs, the ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Wow, cool. Ooh, that Here was really loud. Okay, yeah, what that that needs to it's be turned a down. Field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning, so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. I mean, it, it was be cool. Wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Professor. But what is this knight in the background doing? Track of what I'm learning. Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Ooh, Walk do with I get me to learn and stuff? we shall put it to the test. Can I learn? Chill. We're just walking, man. This way. I want to learn more pupils. Got any more of those? Or is it Guide just the one? Opportunities to practice <gasps> your magic. That's how you aim? Yourself about wizarding law. It's right click, guys. You've been practicing. Uh oh. That wasn't me. I don't know what you're talking about. Practice? I Shooting. certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Man, you sound like a boomer. Just because you didn't have the internet don't mean you got to take it out on us. What you want? Why don't you hey, cast hey, hey. Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide? Like what? He's got six nose hairs and a booger? Revelio. You're standing too close. Ravenclaw bus. This bus created in honor of Ravenclaw House. Reserve. I feel like I could have told the field guide that. Only way to acquire XP. You're joking. Field guide tracks the current challenge of progress, like challenges to continue. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges to unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Okay. Each challenge has tier special rewards, blah, blah, blah. Collect two field guide pages in Hogwarts. Gear appearance reward Hogwarts for Galio Spectacles. Those ugly things? Nah, I'm good. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards. You have unlocked. So what if I don't want to do that? Like that reward seems lame. Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. Look how studious. Oh. and outside of the castle. I was just about to comment how studious you look with that book, bro. Just put it away like that. There's teeth. Ah, oh, these are the pew pews, aren't they? Eh. 
No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Uh, so, so, how do I get to class? This door. Dark hell. What's up, bro? Mm. Should watch where you're walking. Next time, I won't let you off easy with a miss. Ah, what, what, what? Good timing. Perfect Four? opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. <laughs> flu flames. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Does it now? You've discovered a flu flames. Fast shop. You can open the map at any time. Fast shop. Where is said flu flame? Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map where students and professors live and includes the house common rooms and the great hall. Select your grass tricks. This? In this view, you can see flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house common room. Gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. To the right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower. That's where I want to go. Library and greenhouses. So that sounds like the three classes I'm going to have to take in this game, right? Astronomy, horticulture, right? Herbology, what did they call it? Anyway, select the library annex region. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flames for you. I didn't discover it though, how she did that? Use AD to rotate the map and fast travel to the central. Oh. That's pretty cool. Caps lock target lock is an effective tool against an enemy you want to combo or otherwise find a difficult track. Oh. Or really? Rebellio will clearly highlight nearby enemies interactive elements. Oh, okay. So it's like your spidey sense or in like Assassin's Creed games, it's like your eagle vision or whatever it's called. Gotcha, gotcha. We'll use it more often. I wonder, right? Do chess count? Can I revelio chess? Wait on the indicates your active target, blah, 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 blah. Aim mode. I wonder if that hint has come up before and I just didn't see it. So this this loading is unreal. I will pause it and come back when it's loaded. Time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Sorry, you might have missed a little bit of dialogue. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Hehehe. <laughs> Like those tip taps. Always something happening here. How come she don't tip tap? Part of the hive. Oh, she did a little Our tip tap. King's Cross Station, so to speak. King's Cross Station. I don't. I don't really like that they're puking water. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both charms and defense against the dark arts classes today. Oh, I got more classes. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Like, what will I learn in charms class? Yeah, what's exactly a charm? Exactly what you might expect: spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. Mm. I think mm -hmm. you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard so, and a talented teacher. Professor Ronan teaches me more pew pews. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts? Class? I assume it's kind of self explanatory. The dark Arts, as the name implies, mm -hmm. focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who. What's that? What's that in the background? Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Ah, oh, Hecate. 
You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Yeah, it's Hogsmeade where we're gonna go buy a wand or a broom. A village in Britain, and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You it was a flying book. All of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I, I imagine, enjoy many a butter beer there with friends in due course. How do I get the Diagon Alley? It took me, and I'm ashamed to admit this, until my adult years to realize that Diagon Alley is literally diagonally. Diagon Alley. Diagonally. It's like a diagonal strip. I, it's like the most obvious like garlic professor garlic the most obvious like not even really a play on words and i missed it for like i don't remember when i figured it out but it was at least after i was 20. thank you professor weasley a lot to absorb on your first day and you have much to learn. Yeah, Happily, I'm trying to go find some pew pews. Additional assignments for you outside of class. Man. You'll be up to speed in no time. I don't want that. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival. So how does everybody Simply know about what happened after that awful dragon attack? My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I don't know what I lost, so... I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there. Yeah, I taught myself the pew pews. Uh, aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Hey. Well, I'm just glad. Nice schizophrenic. Lived in one place. I could be. Perfectly good boat. One piece. Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say we I chose are, the dragon's path, Professor. On a cruise. Although, unfortunately, it would seem that it chose One us. Piece. Okay, Very I don't well. get copyright strike. Enough chit chat. That was I need to get to class myself. Basically Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, like. to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. I sang the original One Piece theme song, if you didn't know. Good luck today. Thanks. And remember to use your field guide. Sure. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Ooh, that's yes, creepy. Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Okay. I didn't want to, like, go and, like, find her after. But if she's how I get to Hogsmeade, then... Oh, well... Uh, let's see. I, oh, crap. It looks so different. Settings. I need to turn down the volume on this. It is way too loud. Still. Somehow. Eh, maybe let's go to like 30. Maybe like a strong 39 for that. None of those numbers. <laughs> like a flat, even, or like incremental number. It's just like, yeah, 31, 39. Might make some people mad. Okay, so I... Oh, I gotta talk to you? It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today. Before you immersed yourself in studies, did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? That's not what I was trying to do, but yeah. I did my best, but it was all planned. That we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more 
flexibility with your time than she would approve of. Yeah. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Yeah, I don't care about you. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Oh. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. How do we do that? M? I remember already. Oh, yeah, C, M. It just wouldn't let me press anything. The thing represents main quests. Completing a main quest will further the story. Unlock new features and grant XP. I thought they said that the book thing was the only thing that could give you XP. So you can just do quite like your main storyline. The castle. I may need to use the charm compass V in the field guide to help me know. So I can press V. What am I doing here? I'm confused. Oh, I have to continue. <laughs> Some quests are locked by spell and level requirement. Required level, blah, blah, blah. New spells can be earned by completing professor assignments. That's what we got to do. We got to do professor assignments. Get me here. Do I have to press? Oh, right click, right click. Oh. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. Thank this you. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll yeah. enjoy Mr. Ollivander. Yeah. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Cool. 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 I thought for like a split second there was just a giant man playing an instrument from down there. Cast charm compass. Oh, I got a new one. Ooh, look at this. This is cool. Raise to the top. Beat you. This guy's interesting. <laughs> Whoa! Where'd he, <laughs> where'd he go? I, I want to be friends with that guy. Whoa, whoa, my bad. I didn't mean to open it so rude. <laughs> no. Uh -huh. Loser. I don't know if I like this toggle thing. I'm going to change that. this game ever wants to load dang dude what would that be under input side just appears for you to act as a toggle rather than a hold no don't like that So you can press C to walk. Cool, cool, cool. Did that save? Where is it? Okay, yeah, I did. Okie dokie. Let's get going, bud. Eh, beat him, beat him. Render, render. Oh, I don't want to be here. Where's the other one? Holy crap, my computer is struggling. Alright, now I just got a random 
other thing. A valuable side quest can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked as flags and discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward XP but do not advance the main story. Cool. I'm doing all of those. I thought I was supposed to be going here. Right? So why am I in, in the tower or the other one? I'm so lost. Are they in the same tower? Let me open this map again. I'm not understanding where I'm at. Oh, it 100% is in the same place. It was just the angle that I was looking at it. Where is he? Where's the fun guy? That wasn't the fun guy. Is this it? Ah, oh, I thought. Was that you? Did you make that noise? Is that you? Now, you don't really look like you would make that noise. That was not a meow. I don't know what that was. Got like live music. There's so much to explore. I just want to explore it all. In time. In time. Okay, wait. Before I start the quest, right? Oh, I can't spin this one. I wanted to spin it. Let's just start it. What up, y'all? Oh, it's that girl again. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. How do you say that name? Hello, I am Nettie. Nettie. So you are the new student. Or is that her nickname? Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Spelled different in the subtitles. Shall we begin? <laughs> This dude Welcome is hilarious looking. Of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Does anyone know now, what that chain across his robe is called? I've been looking for one of those. Before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer Thanks. must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> You're in trouble because of her. You all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. I don't want her as my partner. She got me in trouble. This again, eh? Akio! Akio! What do you guys say? Akio. Akio! This is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. Might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me.
I don't like her. <laughs> she got me in trouble on my first day. First class, man. How am I supposed to like her? All right. I'm going to pause again. Be back. Hopefully, we don't miss too much dialogue when we do come back. Ah. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? So why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Ah, picking on the new kid. What is this? Wizard hazing? Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm uh, uh, at the last hazard, possible the moment. Now, uh, think of this like again. gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall, yes? Now, I could keep talking about theory all day, but practice is the best, Professor. Yeah, so let Show me do it. I'm pressing four. Akio. Very good. Don't lose your composure. Okay, everything just lagged hella hard. Hello? Akio. That's it! Not to worry. Splendid! Very good! Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Oh, Miss God. Onai, would you care to give our new students Ugh. a bit of a challenge? Come Get rid on of her. Up. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, wow. you are playing red. We're actually Clear? competing right now? Yes, sir. I did terrible in that first game. Oh, 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 what? Here we go. Hello? Oh, do I have to wait for her? Brother. She, she got 50 on the first freaking thing. Akio. So, but so did I. Can you not stand so close to me? I wonder if I do it like this, can I knock her ball out? I'm gonna try to be a dick on my first day. Oh. Quite impressive. I didn't pull it hard enough. Can you? You're like blocking my vision, man. Akio. Yeah. No. <laughs> A perfect score. Remarkable. I hate you. I hate you. I just hope you know that. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? That chain thing is so cool. Now what? Oh, God. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. Mess this it up. Mess it up. Come on, guys. Stop Here eating your apples. Go. Help me. Mess it up. Mess it up. That is how it's done. Yeah? Watch this. Akio. <laughs> That's it. Hey, still got more points than you don't. <laughs> Watch this. Oh, see? You wanna judge me? 
I don't know that you did, but there we go. Oh, give me pace. I'm about to end her whole career. Watch this. Damn! I got this. I, I learned this trick last time. Watch this, watch this. Ready? Watch this. Yeah! Look at that! Two perfect rounds. Yeah! Woohoo! Ended your whole career. See the way I mean mugged her at the end? I didn't even plan Very for that. I was trying to walk away. You. Well done. <laughs> God, I gotta pause again. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Why do I look like that? <laughs> Good game back there. No. I must admit. I think I underestimated you. Yeah, you Took did. Took weeks to become proficient with Akio. Back off. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Man, it's already easy. Where's my mouse? Hello, mouse? Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my Wagadu. fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Cool. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. You got a wizard school in Uganda? Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. So you're that bad at Accio. And you spent how long at this big famous school? Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? It addresses mountains of the moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. But the castle's and cool. And then it just materialized before me. This enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. Is it carved into a mountain or is it floating? This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as Probably it is? Probably not. Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Ah, so we've had similar amounts of practice with a wand then, I feel like. I don't know how long my character's had, but can't be much longer than her. Spells cast without a wand must be less powerful than those cast with a wand. No, no, not at all. Wizarding <laughs> magic cast without a wand is just as powerful. Nah. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. Maybe that's why you suck. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Yes, and out. Until next time. Can I have a new partner? Like, give me one of these guys. I will take the annoying girl. If you're so inclined. A word after my bro. Well, you'd be ah. using it on clothing to be precise. Why are you interrupt? You, know you wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Well, well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. Yeah, what charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professor give care. you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect <laughs> to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. 
Man, not a single soul in your class knew Akio, and yet you guys have the nerve to be like, Psh, you need more practice. Apparently not. Nobody could use Akio. Make it make sense, Hello. man. How was your first day coming along? Where? Oh. <laughs> I would have loved you as a partner over her. Hello, Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. I could help study, you know? How do I walk? See? Look at my tippy taps. Yeah, I just hold down C. You sure? We, we can go to the library or something, you know? Ooh, this is a cool thing. Oh, she's running! She's running! <laughs> okay, where do I gotta go next? I got distracted. You know where I do need to go next is edit this video. This is about all the time I have for for, for this episode. I gotta record another episode right after this. So it will get on. Got to bulk record on my days off of work. Otherwise, I'm just not going to have the time to record because my house is loud. And I got to do it while everyone else is at work. This is cool. Can I zoom? I like that. It's like a unicorn ram goggles wearing cuphead thing. Are these paper birds? Oh, they're cranes. That's cool. I see a chest icon. Where is it? Is it you? Handy resource indeed. Your How do I activate it? I'm most pleased to be included. In the Goblin Rebellion of <gasps> it's the guy! The Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flat. Ooh, fight, fight! <laughs> the bold attack! Was the Minister a boot or the Minister a flack? Stop it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't give Peeves a smack. She says it's a boot and he says it's a flack. Peeves, enough. You'll get us all detention. And you're both wrong anyway. I love this guy. This guy is amazing. Well, I hope that was an awesome way to like end it. So hopefully you guys like this episode. I will hopefully see you for a third.